English for teachers. Okay, so now we are going to move forward to the our next alphabet that is D. So now what we are going to do, we are going to do it very quick. I'm going to say something like this: I'm dainty or graceful. Azan is going to reply as fast as he can, and we are going to do a rapid fire round for the letter D, E, and F, and also G. That's gonna be a bluff. Yeah. So be ready. Fasten your seat belts and get ready for a ballistic journey. Oh, hmm, I'm ready. Yeah. So am I. Okay. Are you ready, Azad? Yes, sir. Okay. Let's go. I'm dainty. You're graceful. You're dainty. <laughs> okay. Yeah. That was an answer. You're decisive or influential. Um, I'm influential. Deferential or respectful. Hmm, you're right. She is deft or adroit or skillful. I don't think so. I'm not delicate or weak. You're right. You're dependent. Maybe. He is delightful. I'm not sure. She is demure or modest. How do you know? I am not depressed. Without doubt. Okay, you're devoted. Oh, really? She isn't dexterous. I think so. He isn't diligent. You're right. They aren't dirty. I don't think so. The man is disagreeable. I'm not sure. The girl is discerning or judicious. Maybe. I am discreet or tactful. How do you say this? You're disruptive or unruly. Oh, really? He is distraught or upset. You shouldn't guess. She is distrustful or suspicious. Hmm, you're right. I'm not dowdy, dated, or old-fashioned. I don't think so. Okay, why not? Okay, moving on. You're not dramatic. You're right. He isn't dreary, dull, or boring. I'm not sure. She isn't drowsy or tired. Maybe. The man is drunk or intoxicated. How do you know? All right, and the next one. The girl is dull or tedious. Without doubt. I am dutiful, compliant, or well behaved. You read my mind. Now moving on to the alphabet E. I'm eager or keen. You're eager. Okay. Now moving on to the next one. You are earnest or solemn. Maybe he's easygoing. Hmm, you're right. She's efficient. I don't think so. I'm not egotistical. Uh, I'm not sure. You're not emotional. Maybe I'm not sure. He isn't energetic. How do you know? She isn't enthusiastic. How do you say this? They aren't even tempered. Oh, really? The man is excellent. Maybe the girl is excitable or emotional. I'm not sure. I'm experienced or knowledgeable. You're right. Now alphabet F. You're fabulous or amazing. I'm fabulous. Okay. He is fastidious or fussy or choosy. Um, you're right. Okay. She is ferocious or violent. How do I know? I am not fervent or eager. Right. You're flashy or showy. Um, I don't know. Okay. He isn't frank or open. You're right. She isn't friendly or welcoming. Maybe. How do I know? They aren't funny or humorous. They are. The man is fussy or picky. I don't know. Now, alphabet G. Okay, let's start. So for G, let's start with the girl is generous. Ah,、uh, that's true. I'm gentle. Hundred percent accurate. You're good. Hmm. Two hundred percent. I've accepted that. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah. And the next one. He is grave or serious. She is both grave and serious. She is groggy or sleepy. 
Mm, I guess she's slippy. Hmm. And the next one. So, here we go. They aren't grouchy or bad-tempered. Maybe. The girl is guarded or protected. Hmm, you're right. Moving on to alphabet H. The man is hateful or odious. Without doubt. I am hurty or energetic. You are. You are helpful. How do I know? I mean, of course you know. Go on, man. Next one. He is helpful. That's hundred percent accurate. He is hesitant or undecided. Um, he is undecided. She is hot-headed or argumentative. Mm, I'm not sure. All right. I'm not hypocritical or critical. Maybe. He isn't hysterical or wild. Mm, I don't think so. All right. The man is idiotic. You shouldn't guess. Okay, so this is alphabet I. All right. That was a good reply, though. We shouldn't guess. <laughs> That's true. And I am idle. Yes, you are. Which is the biggest lie in this universe. <laughs> okay, you are illogical. Hmm, that's true. Maybe this is the second biggest lie of the universe. And he's imaginative. Hmm, that's hundred percent true. She's immature. That's I agree, five hundred percent truth. Hmm, that's brilliant. And moving on. They are immodest. Really? They aren't impatient. Mm, I don't think so. I am imperturbable or controlled or composed. I'm not sure. I'm not impetuous or hasty. Mm, maybe. He is impractical. Without doubt. He isn't impious or bad. Mm, you're right. She is impressive. Mm, I guess. She is impulsive or hasty. Um, maybe. She isn't inactive. You shouldn't guess. They are incisive or keen. Um, they are none of them. Okay, so moving on, we have got. They aren't incompetent. I don't think so. The man is inconsiderate or selfish. Maybe. The girl. Is inconsistent. The man isn't independent. Um, that's true. The girl isn't indiscreet or careless. Oh, really? You should not guess. Okay. I am indolent or lazy. Uh, how do I know? I am indefatigable or untiring. Man, how do I know? That's a good question, and I can't answer that. You are industrious. Mm, now, that's one hundred percent fake. Now you could have said, "How do I know?" Because it's you. Uh, that's one hundred percent fake because I know I'm not. Okay, because he knows. Because I said you are this time. Okay, next one. You aren't inexperienced. Mm, right. All right. Then the next one. He is insensitive. Mm-hmm. He isn't inspiring. Really? She is intelligent. True. She isn't interesting. Ah. Uh -huh. They are intolerant. That's true. I agree with you. They aren't inventive or creative. Without doubt. I am not. Irascible or irritable? Maybe. You are irritable or short-tempered. He's both. You know that really well. Okay, yeah, he's both actually. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now we have completed up to I. Now is the turn of J. We should celebrate it, right? How? That's a good question. Let's let's cut a cake. Because we're done with, uh, how many letters? Oh, so let's count A, B, C, D, E, 
So let's count A B C D E F G H I. So nine letters. Nine letters. So yes, let's uh, complete cut a cake. Okay, let's complete the rest of them, and inshallah we'll cut a cake. So now moving on to our letter J. So I'm jocular or funny. You are funny. You are jovial or jolly. Um, I'm not sure. He's joyous. Ah,、uh, that's true because his name is Joy. <laughs> okay. How do you know that his name is Joy? Okay. That's a very big question with、mm. a very big, big answer. answer. Okay. She is judgmental. Hmm. How do I know? You should know that. Yeah, you're absolutely right. So, next one. I'm not keen or eager. Um. Yes. You aren't kind or benevolent. Without doubt. She isn't lazy or indolent. Uh, maybe. He is leery or doubtful. How do I know? They are lethargic or lazy. They are lazy. He is level-headed. Maybe. The man is listless. I'm not sure. The girl is lively. Without doubt. I am logical. Yes, that's true. You're lovable. Mm-hmm. Thank you so much. The man is lovely. Um, I guess. I am not mature. That's not true. You aren't mean. Mm-hmm. Really. Okay. Yeah. So this is letter M, everyone. She is meddlesome or intrusive. He isn't methodical. Ah,、uh, that's true. Okay, and moving on. I am meticulous. Really? He is mild. Or she is miserable. I don't know. They are modest. You read my mind. And now letter N. They aren't naive. You shouldn't guess. The man is nasty. Without doubt. Okay, yeah. So maybe this man is you. Um. Yeah, that's the that's true. I mean, the name of the person is you. Oh, okay. <laughs> that's a good point. The name of the person is Abul Hasnadazan. Oh, that's true. I mean, I had a friend whose name was Abul Hasnadazan, and yeah, you're right. He was so nasty. And I have a ghost recording with me. Okay. Oh, that's sitting beside you. I mean, we have also,、uh, I mean, a person、uh, whose name is Abul Hasan Azan, and he's actually not visible, and、okay. um, you actually can't hear his voice because、oh, yeah. uh, he's not here. He's a ghost. So maybe it's all hallucination. Okay, so let's just move forward.、Uh, man's funny. Mr. Azan is very funny. He has got good sense of humor. Oh really? Okay, don't ask me questions again, or I'll say negative things. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so the next one. She is a naughty. How do you know? Okay, yeah, that's a good question. He is negative. That's true. They are nervous. Yeah, they are actually. The man is noisy. You are absolutely right. I can't actually take him. Okay, and he is nosy. Oh, really? You are normal. That's a very normal sentence indeed. <laughs> okay, that was a very good reply. Credits to you. She is numb or frozen. Um, I don't know. Okay, and the next one. Moving on to alphabet O. I'm obliging. You're right. You are obnoxious. I don't think so. She is old-fashioned. You're right. He is one-sided. I'm not sure. They're orderly. Maybe. The man is ostentatious. How do you know? Okay, and the next one. The girl is outgoing. Without doubt. I'm not sociable. Ah,、uh, that's true. Okay, you aren't outspoken. You shouldn't guess. 
Now, moving on to letter P. He isn't passionate. Mm, you're right. She isn't ardent. Uh, I don't think so. They aren't passive. You're right. Great. And the man isn't patient. Maybe. The girl isn't peaceful. How do I know? I am peevish. Oh, really? You are pensive or thoughtful. You shouldn't give. Hmm. He is persevering. I don't know. She is persnickety. I guess so. They are petulant. Really? They aren't picky. Hmm, that's true. They aren't plain or simple. How do you know? Hmm, the man isn't plain speaking. Without doubt. I am playful or good humored. Maybe. Okay, not maybe, I am actually. The next one. You are pleasant. I'm not sure. He's plucky. You're right. She's polite. I don't think so. They're popular. Hmm, you are absolutely right. The man's positive. How do you know? The girl is powerful. Without doubt. I'm not practical. You read my mind. <laughs> okay, so y these things are going on in your mind. Um, not really. Okay, the girl isn't pretty or cute. How do you know? Okay, um, the man isn't proficient or expert. Maybe. I am proud. I'm not sure. You're provocative. You're right. He is prudent. I don't think so. She is punctual. Mmm, you're right. How do you know it, Safwan? Because I've got a big brain. Okay, and moving on to our next alphabet, that is Q. Here we go. I'm not quarrelsome. Okay, nice to know that. <laughs> You're not querulous. Good job. Thank you so much. Okay, she isn't quick or fast. Um, you're right, maybe. He isn't quick-tempered or fiery. That's 100% true. Okay, the man is quiet or silent. He is quiet. Page 237. Now, we are moving on to the alphabet R. I am realistic. Really? You are reassuring. That's true. He is reliable. Hmm, you're right. She is reluctant. Maybe. Alright. I am not resentful. Without doubt. You are reserved. You are read my mind. Okay. He isn't resourceful. You shouldn't give that. She is respected. Mm, you're right. Okay, moving on. They aren't respectful. I don't think so. They are responsible. I'm not sure. The man is restless or respected. Maybe. Okay, and the girl is revered. Without doubt. I am ridiculous. How do you know? Because I am ridiculous. <laughs> Okay, and now my favorite alphabet is S because, you know, my name starts with an S. I am sad. That's not true. You look like you're so happy. Okay, he is sassy. Maybe. He is self-assured. You're right. She is selfish. Hmm, that's true. I am sensible. I agree with you. You are not sensitive. Maybe. He isn't sentimental. Without doubt. She isn't serene or calm. I'm not sure. Okay. And moving on to the next one. They aren't serious. Hmm, you are right. They are sharp or intelligent. I guess. The man is short-tempered. You read my mind. The girl is shrewd or clever. 
How do you say this? I'm not shy or introverted. That's not true. Yeah, that is not true. Okay, and you aren't silly or stupid. Um, that's hundred percent true. And the next one, he is sincere. Um, I guess he is. Yeah, probably. She is sleepy or drowsy. Hmm, you're right. The man is slight or small. Mm, you should not give that. Okay, yeah, that's true. And the girl is slothful or lazy. Without doubt. You are slow. How do you say this? Because you are slow, man. <laughs> I'm not slow like you. Okay, yeah, both of us are faster than the speed of light. That's true. And yeah, this one totally goes with me. I'm smart or stylish. Mm, I'm not sure. <laughs> okay. He is snobby or superior. Mm, you're right. He isn't somber or serious. That's hundred percent true from my opinion. Okay. She is sober or clear-headed. Uh, maybe. She isn't sophisticated or stylish. I don't think so. Mm hmm. The man is soulful or sad. You're right. The girl is spirited or brave. Without doubt. And the next one is, I am spiteful or hateful. You shouldn't give that. Hmm. You are stable. You read my mind. He is steady or firm. Maybe. She is stoic. Uh, that's not true. Okay. I am striking or outstanding. That's hundred percent true. You are strong. Um, you can say that. He isn't stupid. Uh, really? Uh, I guess he is stupid a lot. Okay. She is sturdy or strong. Mm, I'm not sure. Okay. The man is super curious. Really? The girl is suspicious. I don't know about her. Congratulations. We are done with the alphabet S. That's really amazing. And now it's time for the alphabet T. So you want a cup of tea? Um, not really. Uh, I... I love coffee better than tea. Okay, yeah, same here. I love coffee more than tea. So, let's get started, I guess. I am tactful or diplomatic. Mm, I'm not sure. Okay, you are tactless. Uh, maybe it can be. He is talented. Uh, I think so, he is. She is testy or irritable. I don't think so. I'm not thinking. Really? How can I know about you are thinking or not? <laughs> <laughs> okay. You aren't thoughtful. Um, you know that really well. He is thoughtless. Uh, you're right. Okay. And the next one is... He isn't timid. You read my mind. She isn't tired or exhausted. Uh, without doubt. The man is tolerant or forbearing. You shouldn't guess that. The girl is touchy or sensitive. I'm not sure. We are done with alphabet T. Oh, congratulations. Okay, now it's time for the alphabet U. So, Means you. You. So are you, you are ready? A letter, right? Yeah, I'm not a letter. You is a letter. You is a letter. Yeah. Who is that you? That is the alphabet U. Alphabet U. That's so confusing. Yeah. U, U, U. Okay. And not you, but it's you. Some people say you. That's me. That means disgusting. Exactly. So our first word totally matches with you, Azan. You are ugly or unattractive. Um, that's true, Safwan. Um, as like as you, boss. <laughs> okay. Yeah, that's funny. I mean, both of us are really handsome, but, you know, 
It's recording, so we are having a bit of fun. I am unaffected. Really, I can't believe that. So you want me to be affected by coronavirus? <laughs> <laughs> Not really. Just kidding, man. Okay, and he is unbalanced. Who? Good question. She is uncertain. Um, I don't think so. I am not uncooperative. How do you say this? That's totally fake. Okay. Um, you aren't undependable. Um, maybe. He is unemotional. Hmm. Have to think about that. She is unfriendly. Um, I guess. The man is unguarded. Oh, really? I don't know about him. The girl is unhelpful or uncooperative. You read my mind. I am unimaginative. Oh, uh, you're not right. You are unmotivated. Oh, that's totally true. I agree with you. Okay. She is unpleasant. Ah, uh, I hundred percent agree with you. Okay, the man is unpopular. Uh, that's true. Unpopular like us. <laughs> yeah, maybe we'll be popular in Shalla in the future. In Shalla. And I am unreliable. Um, without doubt. You are sophisticated, unsophisticated for sure. You read my mind. <laughs> okay, so the girl is unstable or unsteady. Um, I guess so. She is unsure or hesitant. Um, maybe. The man is unthinking. Uh, I don't know. She is unwilling or reluctant. Uh, you shouldn't guess that. Okay, so we are done with the alphabet U. So moving on to the next page. Page two hundred and thirty-eight. Alphabet V. Can you show your V sign? Yeah, there you go. But no one can see it except me. Yeah, V for victory, definitely. V for victory, not victory. Victory. Victory, yes. Okay. So our first word is. It's one of my favorite words. That is, I'm versatile or multi-talented. Ah, uh, that's hundred percent true, except with him. Okay, yeah. So we use the word versatile. It's a very beautiful word. So we sometimes say computer is versatile, which means that computer can do many things. Like at once, you are conducting a class, you are texting, and you're also, I mean, doing a lot of stuff at once. And that's really a talent exactly. that you have. Exactly. And it's possible for computers only, but it's also possible for humans to do multitasking. But computer is unparalleled. The best example. Exactly. And you are vigilant or watchful. Ah,、uh, you're right. He is vulnerable or helpless. Ah,、uh, I don't accept with you. Okay. Now, W. Really, we're done with V. Yeah, only three words. That was so less. Yeah, but there are some more words for W.、Mm-hmm. Okay. So I am warm-hearted or affectionate. Um, I'm not sure, Safwan. Okay. You are wary or cautious. Ah,、uh, without doubt. He is watchful or alert. How do you say this? He is not. She is weak or feeble. Um, you read my mind. I'm not well behaved. Ah,、uh, that's not true. You aren't well developed. Um, I don't think so. He is well respected. Ah,、uh, that's true. He is. She is well rounded or attractive. Maybe I'm not sure. Okay, and the man is willing or eager. Ah,、uh, I also think so. I am wonderful or amazing. Um, you're not wonderful and you're not amazing. You're more than amazing. Okay, thank you. Thank you for the good twist and turn. 
and the last letter that is Z. Z. Z is for zoo. Yeah, for you, where you belong, is that right? Yes. <laughs> okay. And so you belong in a zoo. Yeah, that's true. Um, I belong in a zoo with a person whose name is um, Mustafa. Okay. And there is a word before Mustafa, which is Safwan, and he is sitting beside me. Okay. And after the recording, we are actually ready for going to the zoo. Okay. Yeah. So we came straight from the zoo to do the recording, right? Right. Okay. So there is only one word for the letter Z. That is, you are not jealous, but you are zealous, which means enthusiastic. Um, you're right. I'm not jealous. I'm zealous. Okay. So we are done with all the alphabets. We have learned thousands and thousands of adjectives. Use these words and enhance your English. Now, below this. There are some quotations. Let's read it. Quotation one: In the classroom, a teacher isn't just shaping minds; they are sculpting the architects of tomorrow, one lesson at a time. Quotation two: Teaching is not only about transmitting knowledge, but also about fostering resilience, creativity, and the unwavering belief. That every student has the potential to achieve greatness. A teacher's impact extends far beyond grades. It's a legacy of inspiration, a testament to the enduring influence they have had on shaping the world through the lives of their students. Quotation four: Teaching is a noble calling. A journey of planting seeds of wisdom, nurturing the growth of knowledge, and watching the blooms of empowered minds flourish in the garden of education. That's all for lesson number five. Thank you so much for staying with us. See you in lesson six of part four. Tara. Tara.